This video will describe the ways to log into eLearn. My name is Loot and I will be conducting this video. There's two ways to get into the eLearn website. The first way is to go to our website which is www.acot.edu. As you scroll down and look to your left you will see enrolled students. If you'll click that you'll be brought to the welcome page. First thing you'll notice immediately is that we use this area here to post any messages to our students. You can also chat with Student Services Administration and Technical Support by clicking one of these two links here. To access the class, click on this link. You'll be presented for a username and password. Unless you're instructed otherwise, your username and password are as follows. Your first name dot last name and then your um, your password is the last six of your social and you can change this at any time but for the time being the social security number you have on file with the school is used to make part of your password so I'll be logging in as a guest for the time being this screen is the course categories or what we call the welcome screen in eLearn You'll notice there is a long list of current courses that are going on right now in the center. You'll notice on the left side you have student services. Scroll down a little bit further and you'll have general links. And notice again the online help button. You'll find these buttons throughout our eLearn platform. It's a great way to chat with any of our support staff here at American College. Now if this is your first class, and for most new students it is, you will have CIS 100 information technology and distance learning so locate that class and click on it so the first thing you'll notice of course is a picture of your instructor if you look to your far right you'll see student services again this is the same menu you saw out in the general area and of course general links later on in your orientation booklet these items will be brought up to you so let's just take a moment here to recognize that we are in our weekly outline and we are currently viewing our class and as you scroll down you'll be able to see your week one week two so on and so forth and this has been a video on how to sign into eLearn